This exhibition is the very first exhibition uh, devoted to Van Gogh's self-portraits across his entire career. It seems incredible that there hasn't been an exhibition like that in the past, but it's because these works are so precious to their collections that they're very rarely lent. Um, and so it's been, it's been a long time coming. Very few artists, actually, I think we don't realize that, um, made as many self-portraits as Van Gogh did. He made 35 in the space of only three and a half years. Uh, that's really quite unparalleled in the, in the history of art. Um, and so we wanted to understand what it was about this genre that appealed to him so much. And actually what we found is that it was a wonderful way of charting his artistic development over those three uh, and a half years. It was the end of his life, but it's really the moment that he came into his own and became the Van Gogh that we know. I think Van Gogh is such an iconic painter. If you think of someone's self-portraits, you think of Van Gogh. It's so famous. And also, it's not just his inimitable style, it's also his story. People love this story of this artist who struggled with mental health, who had a difficult upbringing, a very intense individual. And every portrait you look at, even when he's got a straw hat on to make it look a bit lighter, you can still see he's got that intense stare in his eyes and his angular features. He's a very distinctive looking person and you can really see that in all of his self-portraits. And you can see in this exhibition, there's lots of different styles and they weren't painted that far apart. You can see very realist paintings, you see pointillist paintings, you can see this signature style that he's known for. They're all in this exhibition all over the course of three years. And it goes to show what a diverse talent he was in terms of painting style, but also what an iconic painter he remains today.